My passions in life are Australian rules football. I'm a junkie for football, I love it. Second only to my wife and my family, of course, whom I love very dearly. I love my grandkids to bits. There's only one way to sum it up, I just love life. I enjoy life. I guess there's just some days that I wake up afraid. I spent all my years, or most of my years, in the glazing I trade, working on multi-storey buildings in the city. I, I was in my 40s, I'd seen some terrible accidents on site, so I came home and said to my Every wife, um, I'm going to give this away and get a job down at ground level where I'm safer and at least I'll be coming home for dinner of the night. Every time you hold me so close My last no memory of that day was stepping off the landing on the forklift. I woke up eight days later in intensive care at the Austin Hospital and I was what they call a T4 complete paraplegic. Every time we say goodbye and I hang my head I lost my confidence to go outside so I just tended to stay home and I suppose in the time that I did stay home all I was longing for was to be able to get out there really and, and do it. I just needed an opening to be able to do that, to go out and, and I wasn't quite sure what what that was going to be that would lead me to do that. The van came into my life and it opened my lifestyle or my life to such an extent um, I just can't measure it because it's the difference now to what I was is just immeasurable. I love my van dearly. I don't even see myself as wheelchair bound. I, I, I'm, I'm human again. I'm back to what I wanted to be. I'm back out there. I'm a person. He's just got his independence back and he's, he, he's his old self again. And I just sit in the passenger seat and, and he drives his own van. He drives me around again now, um, which is good. It has put me back out into the world um, I've always been fitness orientated. I do swimming twice a week, Monday, Friday, and I do gym work twice a week, Tuesday, Thursday. He was very athletic before um, he had his accident. Um, he's now still athletic, but in a slightly different way. You know, he's, he's adjusted to that. And where he used to go jogging before, he now goes to the gym and he goes swimming. So he's still active with his Activan. <laughs> Through gaining the van, they've given me back my independence, my dignity, and most of all, my happiness.